So today, we're going to talk about dry fasting. I want to give you a quick update on my hard day dry fast day one, right? Now, day one is not the hardest day, obviously, and most of you guys might say now, hey, come on, Ralphie boy, you actually do that almost every day, which is true. I eat only one meal a day, and I stay dry for about 16 hours every day. So that's a normal protocol for me. But I can tell you one thing, guys. Knowing I'm going on a seven-day plus hard dry fast, uh, just the mental aspect of it is crazy. Same as you go, uh, you know, if you're competitor and you're competing and fighting, say, or any kind of sport, but fighting probably in particular. You know, you train every day, you have lots of sparring sessions and, and, and hundreds of hundreds of hundreds of sessions, but when you actually go up to the fight, you're still super excited, you're still super nervous, and it's the same here now. So it's not the same what I usually do. Even the first day was a bit different. Uh, 